so hello, my name is Janelle Jim and I'm a senior at Urbana High School. I think throughout COVID, I really had to persevere a lot. It was so hard for me to learn online, especially as a student who's always done well academically. It just didn't stick in my brain. So for me, it was really hard just because I wasn't doing as well as I normally did. And for me, like I always placed like my self-worth on my academics. And once my academics start to not do so well, it's then my self-worth starts to you know tank as well. I think to persevere isn't necessarily to always be optimistic. A lot of times it's really just knowing that you have to get back up because there's always more things to do. There's always something else that needs to be done. So to me, it's not necessarily being, you know, having a happy-go-lucky attitude. Sometimes, um, you know, I really don't want to get up. I, I'd rather just stay home, but after something bad happens, but you know, I guess you have to persevere through it and you have to, get up and you have to do what you have to do because you know it's just going to cause more stress on you if you're not you know on your toes all the time. I will be going to George Washington University in DC um, I'll be majoring in political science so there's a good chance I'll switch to international relations um, and then after that I'm definitely like very involved in like political sphere governments so that's definitely like my niche what I like to do um, so there's probably a chance of me either going to law school afterwards or going into the public sector um, doing something with the government that's really what I love to do and that's what I hope to accomplish there at the school. For me during COVID I was really able to just you know the world slowed down and once the world slowed down my mind started to slow down I was actually really thinking about those things that I didn't really get the time of day before because I had A, B, C, D to do. And now that I really don't, I really didn't have all of those things to do, I really was able to think about myself where my place, um, you know, how I really viewed myself. And so to anyone who's really struggling with that right now, I'd say what's really important is taking a step back and reevaluating what you deem as success and whether or not that success is healthy because you can have everything in the world, but if you're miserable, if you're doing the things that you don't like just for the sake of, you know, being successful, then at the end of the day, you're really not winning. I think that's the biggest loss that you could have.